welcome back everyone in this video tutorial I will give you example of half wave rectification in Proteus so let's start it as you are electrical engineer so you already know uh, what components we need for half wave rectification uh, for half wave uh, rectification circuit we have a need of uh, a diode a resistor and AC voltage source so let's pick uh, a diode from libraries right diode or uh, if you uh, know the name of any kind of diode you can also write it for example I know the name of 1N4007 so it is appearing in uh, results double click on uh, 14007 and click OK now how to uh, now I will quickly make a circuit of uh, half wave rectification uh, AC voltage source uh, a diode and a resistor I'm doing all these things quickly because I assume that you already know how to make a circuit in uh, Proteus and uh, if you don't know then go to my last couple of tutorials uh, about Proteus now again I use a uh, ground connected across uh, an active terminal or uh, we have to use AC source uh, here is uh, AC source connected cross uh, ground and uh, diode positive terminal I assume that you know what is diode if you don't know diode then uh, I probably consider you are at the wrong place uh, now uh, double click on uh, uh, AC sign uh, AC source to adjust its parameters again set let's suppose we want uh, we set it to uh, 120 uh, 120 volt and we set the frequency on 50 hertz you can set it according to your requirement uh, I'm setting it because this this is just for demonstration purpose and uh, to uh, to tell you how to make uh, a a uh, half rectification, half wave rectification circuit in Proteus. Now, uh, le let's suppose I adjust it to, to 12k. Okay. Now, you know what uh, what will be the output of half wave rectification circuit? Uh, negative negative cycle will not appear across uh, R1. This uh, output of uh, if you don't know, then. Uh, output of half wave rectification circuit is what is the output of half wave rectification circuit output of half wave rectification circuit is the positive cycles only negative cycle will not appear across R1 so how to check it in Proteus simply you can use uh, a oscilloscope as I have already told you uh, the way to use a oscilloscope in Proteus go to uh, virtual terminals select oscilloscope and uh, you want to uh, measure voltage across uh, R1 uh, connect oscilloscope across R1 now again play it uh, again set the timings and uh, voltages and you can also you can uh, set the position with uh, um, with the help of position cursor as you can see negative voltages are not appearing across R1 only positive cycle is appearing across uh, R1 so this is the output you uh, have uh, seen in books and while studying in um, half wave rectification so uh, let's me let me tell you another way to uh, see your results in Proteus without using uh, uh, oscilloscope another way is to uh, use to see uh, a, uh, any kind of wave or AC wave in Proteus is to use graph. To use graph, you have to use uh, voltage probe or current probe. For example, click on this probe option and select a voltage probe and connect it across uh, uh, wherever you want to measure voltage. For example, I want to measure voltage across R1 and ground. Connect it. Uh, connected uh, with the, a terminal uh, with one terminal of uh, R1 and another terminal of uh, R1 should be connected with ground. Now uh, 
to measure voltage uh, to uh, to see uh, any kind of wave on graph uh, go to go to graph mode and select analog because we are connected ic voltage source it is analog so connect uh, connect to, uh, so click on analog and uh, draw a square as you as you assume that you know how to draw a square uh, and draw a square and this uh, this graph is appearing now click on your voltage probe and uh, uh, and uh, drag it in, into your analog anal uh, analog analysis window now you can see r12 uh, has been written on your uh, graph now to simulate graph uh, where is this going to simulate graph uh, right click on graph and uh, click the option simulate graph as you can see uh, half wave rectification waves are pairing on this graph you uh, you can also increase its size okay because we have set the time uh, to uh, one second that's why uh, we are uh, not seeing it uh, completely uh, it is not visible uh, there is uh, to set its a time limit uh, right click on right click on graph and go to edit graph and uh, set the timing start timing and stop and we, we want to start from zero and we want to end on uh, let's suppose we want to and we want only want to see three cycles to so set it 60 milli okay and uh, uh, now uh, this is uh, now Prot is asking from you you want to re-simulate it yes we want to re-simulate it now you can see only three cycles are appearing next cycle is not appearing because we are using half wave rectification thanks for watching this video i will com come back to you with another example in next tutorial. Allah Hafiz.